Hello, royal folks. It's good to see you all here again. This is your regular dose of royal news and analysis. But before we start, please subscribe to my channel and click the bell icon. Thanks. So, Prince Harry recently made a solo appearance at a star-studded football match in Los Angeles. While other celebrities had their professional titles cited, the prince, alongside his wife Meghan Markle, had none mentioned. This has left many intrigued about the couple's current roles beyond their previous royal responsibilities. The Duke of Sussex was seen in the director's box enjoying the match between Los Angeles Football Club, LAFC, and David Beckham's Inter Miami. The match featured football legend Lionel Messi playing for Inter Miami. Notably absent, however, was Meghan Markle, leading to speculation as to why she could not make it to the game. The VIP guest list for this event was a who's who of global celebrities. It included names from various industries, from Hollywood A-listers like Leonardo DiCaprio, Tom Holland, and Selena Gomes, to sports icons like Magic Johnson and LeBron James. All were clearly identified by their professions, unlike Harry and Meghan. It's worth mentioning that Harry hasn't historically been a football enthusiast. While living in the UK, he supported the Arsenal Football Club, but openly confessed his love for rugby over football, according to the Daily Mail. However, his evident enthusiasm during the LA game could possibly signal a newfound interest, or perhaps it was a nostalgic connection to his homeland. Musicians like Liam Gallagher from the UK and Rage Against the Machine also graced the event with their presence. Their professions, much like those of other celebrities, were mentioned in the official press release by the LAFC. The presence of Harry without any cited roles on the VIP list hints at the ongoing public uncertainty regarding his and Meghan's current professional engagements after their royal exit. Prince Harry is scheduled to return to the UK for a brief visit. He's attending the annual Well Child Award ceremony in London, a charitable organization for which he still serves as a patron. However, he is unlikely to meet his family, King Charles and Prince William. So what do you think about this news, guys? Thank you for tuning in to today's discussion. As always, I encourage you to share your thoughts in the comments section below. Stay tuned for more updates on the intriguing world of royalty. Until then, thanks for watching. We'll see you again with some more fascinating news about the royal family. Thank you.